So it is about two o'clock in the morning. I have been trying to go to sleep since like 10 because I want to go to the gym at 5 30. But I can't sleep. It's just a lot on my mind. It's a lot of things that I'm working on and my brain just will not sit still and let me rest. But I had a moment that I thought would be helpful to share and um, just with someone that's also going through their healing journey. So I have been going through this healing journey for like the past few years, letting go of relationships and people that don't mean me well and are not good for me and my mental health and literally letting go of all of the emotions attached to people. So this was a really uh, big epiphany for me a few minutes ago and I wanted to share it. So there's a song like, you know, how sometimes you associate songs with people because that's just who we are by nature. When you have when you when you smell certain things, you think about where you were when you first smelt those things like different fragrances may remind you of someone always, right? Even if you don't smell it for a while, if you smell that scent, it comes back to you. So like my my ex, my son's father, who has passed away, I don't know, I think it's been, it's been a while, maybe eight years. It's been a long time. But he used to always wear Curve for Men and I don't know if you guys know what that is, but that is an old school, really good smelling man scent, right? So I haven't smelt it for years, but if I smelled it now, it would remind me of when we met in our first date and just that time when it was like, you know, all innocent when I was like 19, 18, 19. So it would remind me of that. So with this, I heard a song, right? This song, I have not been able to listen to this song for two years. It would bring me so much pain and hurt because it reminded me of a specific person that meant so much to me in that time and that meant so much to me for so long, but um, I couldn't listen to it because of the things that occurred in our relationship and how everything ended. I couldn't listen to it. It hurt too much to listen to this specific song. And it played while I was trying to go to sleep because I listen to music to go to sleep sometimes. And it played while I was trying to go to sleep. And I could I could let the whole thing go through and not feel any type of way and not have that hurt tug at my heart. And I attribute that to healing. I attribute that to doing the work. I attribute that to love, self-love, self-care, self-reflection, and just doing the healing work. Um, I was able to listen to the whole song all the way through without any issues. So I am super proud of that moment and I wanted to share it because I think someone else could benefit from hearing that story or knowing about that and knowing that if you are currently experiencing anything, if you're going through heartbreak, if you're going through hurt, if you are pain in pain about something or about a relationship, about a circumstance, know that if you do the self work, if you do that internal hard, deep soul searching work, there is a light at the end of the tunnel. There's growth, there is wisdom, there is care for yourself. And um, it's just an amazing feeling. So I just wanted to share that it is possible to get past and get over the things that you have encountered and experienced. And not to say forget it, but use it as a tool to learn and to grow. Because once you have gotten past that hurdle of hurt and pain, there is nothing but greatness on the other side. You will never be the same person again. But at the same time, is that a bad thing? Because you're growing, you're learning, you're developing, and you're transitioning into a new chapter in life. So that's my piece for today. So stay encouraged, stay motivated, stay inspired, keep doing the in internal work. It will definitely pay off. Also, shout out to Lisa Smiles. This is her bonnet. Um, I love this bonnet. Pink is my favorite color. 
and it's very soft and it's protecting my afro and my hair until I get it done. Anywho, I will touch base with you guys later. Hopefully, I can get a self and wellness tip in sometime today. But have a good morning and we'll touch base later. Bye.